good afternoon. So I didn't look in on the old lady group for a couple of days. I'm sure there's tons of stories. I guess I have to start uh, <laughs> looking and making notes. But um, Megan Kelly's hair, Megan Kelly's hair, actually, I think she owned the same unit <laughs> that I'm wearing now. I used to look at um, Brooke Baldwin and Megan Kelly and other female newscasters on a regular basis. And um, yeah, see? Um, and um, I belong to these different hair groups. I don't go into them as much anymore, or hardly ever really. And um, one of the things, many things that we did was we would like name famous stars or um, newscasters that you saw like on the daily or um, maybe like a famous actress in a particular movie or um, on a TV show. And we were able to guess the manufacturer and the color and the exact style of the unit because when you've had that many years of um, um, extensions, hair pieces, and wigs experience and belong to all these hair groups, you can the most perfectly applied, well blended thing still, especially if you observe someone daily, you can pretty much tell even if it doesn't look fake. And so Brooke Baldwin and Megan Kelly, um, I'm sure used stuff. I don't blame them, you know? Who wants to sit in a hairdresser's chair for five hours and then like 10 minutes later, it looks like crap under the hot lights. So, um, yeah, so I noticed it was this thing all over the news about, oh, Megan Kelly got a haircut. No, I think her hair was like that all along. And she just showed herself wearing stuff like this and um, maybe she got tired of it and now she's just sporting her regular hair. So that, that's my story of the day. Um, and the joke is, is that um, I've stolen <laughs> Megyn Kelly's hair. <laughs> so everyone, have the day that you deserve. Bye.